All right, today we have another track from Eminence, Desolation. This is part of my reaction. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Eminence, Desolation. Oh, yeah. And we got our buddy Randall in the studio today. Yeah. How's it, how's it going, guys? How's it going, man? Dude, I know you love music as much as I, we do. <laughs> I do. I do. You comment on all our videos. <laughs> you live like, I don't know, an hour, 30 minutes away. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And uh, so we were going to bring you back because we're going to be leaving the studio yep. soon. Yep. So we wanted you in the studio Absolutely. and you love music as much as we do. Absolutely. So I'm did, hoping to Did hear you it. like the last Eminence song we did? Yes. Yes. I really yeah, did. I okay. dug it too. It I, I thought these guys were, and we had seen their clips before. They were actually trending on TikTok with, with some of their clips from their, like they have this in studio yeah. session that they do. And with the violins and stuff, and it, yeah. and it was like these quick clips. I was like really intrigued by. Yeah. When we listened to that full song, I was like, "Dude, this is pretty good. It's pretty like big, pretty powerful." It was not disappointing. And uh, I'm I'm guessing that this is going to be right up that alley as well. We heard a clip, and it sounded pretty heavy. Yeah. I got to be honest with yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, imminence, uh, desolation. Let's get this thing rolling, man. Let's I'm excited as hell, dude. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Oh, this is from the last video, too. Please tie in. Remember the door and he fell in flames? Mm Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah, that, this I like this one better than the first one. I, I do, do too. too. <laughs> I do too. This, this is good. this is a combination though. If you remember at the end of the first one, he was running in the field and there was the door. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, this is some monsters ink shit, because I got the door that's just floating around, dude. But then there was like the fire, remember and shit? And then mm -hmm. they he wakes up on the on the mm -hmm. grass yeah. with the door still in front. So this is almost like a second part, I'm thinking to that mm -hmm. first song. But I'm getting a lot of like 2005, six mm -hmm. vibes from this. I love the the slow chords during the chorus. Yeah. It's so sick. But the way he it sings, is. that like desolation. Yeah. You know, like it has like this Chiodos vibe to it. Mm -hmm. Like the, like this era, that kind of Vans Warped Tour era where they yeah. were being heavy, but they were also a little experimental still and beautiful. That's good, dude. I this mean, it almost good. seemed like during that second chorus part, the 808 at the very beginning was even heavier mm -hmm. than the first time. Dude. 
I gotta be honest with you. This singer's a panty dropper, bro. Like, <laughs> a, he, can, he can sing, then he busts out the violin like some fucking anchorman shit. With yeah, the, yeah. Just, <laughs> how do you do that? Jeez, oh, man. That's and the so ladies good. are like, "What? What? <laughs> what? You can caress me and play this beautiful ancient music? It's great, dude. <laughs> Let's finish yeah. this thing up, man. Okay. We still got a little bit. I, I, this is great. Cool this is I great, dude. Okay. Their style too. Yeah, it's very cool. That was really good. It kind of makes sense. They were playing in this like dirt hole. Yeah. It's almost like that's where they were like laid to rest and he's coming out and grabbing the key, <sighs> man. Dude, their whole like listen, these guys are really, really good. Pretty they're, impressive, they're awesome. man. Yeah. Their style is very, very cool. Like it's like an old uh lighthouse worker. Yeah. You know what I mean? And mm. then they got like the robes. Yeah. It's uh it's like almost <clears throat> like uh, you know, with the string instruments and their like their their wardrobe selections, it's almost like a like a plantation metal. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know about like the robes. that time era, the robes. Yeah. The, the band wears robes. No, he was wearing like the, the straps and the fucking, he was, but yeah. the band actually wears robes. Well, they almost has like a ghosty thing. We were talking mm-hmm. about them earlier, but yeah, like, yeah, a little bit. How yeah. they, like the band in itself has this whole kind of personality and he's like out in the forefront a little bit with the, it's you know. definitely an, Old school old world. style. Yeah. Old, yeah, old world style. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Well, they're just incorporating all that in, right? Mm. It's really like, because we've heard violins and stuff yeah. inside metal before, yeah. but we haven't seen it where the singer is just fuck screaming, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I've never seen someone scream like that in a, in the, as a front man and be playing no, violin. Yeah. That's no, and it's not too busy. And that's one thing I really like about these guys mm-hmm. is that you can hear it in there. They incorporate it in their music, but they're not putting it out like too much. Or you're like, oh, this whole violin thing's like just, you know, because you could really go too far with it. Mm-hmm. And I think he just does enough to like enhance the sound yeah. and yeah. then like lets his voice do the rest. You know yeah. what I mean? It's cool, dude. Yeah, that was I, awesome. I, I mean, I'm giving, that's on the playlist. Yeah, well, that sure. and the, him having that in his hand, I mean, it almost adds more of a, a dramatic effect to him singing than just holding a, a guitar would. Yes. Because now he's like, he's screaming, and then when he gets to a like, isolation, he like, both hands go away, Mm -hmm. and he's got things in both hands, and he's just like, ugh. Do you like that one more than the first one? I think so. I think I see, so. now I'm going to have to wash him back. Yeah, I know. I, I need to watch the other one again, too. Because the other one was good, it but was. I, I think this was heavier, yeah. if I'm not mistaken. I feel like this is a heavier yeah. song as a yeah. whole. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was, I think. Damn, where? see, that's what I'm saying. Where have we been, man? Yeah. Where are these guys just <laughs> pop up? It's probably, yeah. probably been around for four years. Yeah. Never heard a track from no, these guys. Yeah. <sighs> All right, that was cool, then. Hey, if you like what we do, though, make sure you follow, like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell. It helps us out tremendously. And what else, Chris? Yeah, if you want to help during the show, all the money we make goes back to the artist like it should. Head down there in the description. We got a cash app link. You can donate whatever you want. Yep. Also, you can help Patreon for two bucks a month and request any video you'd like and see it. Everything that doesn't make it to YouTube. Yeah, we want to thank Randall for sitting in on Absolutely. that one. Absolutely, hit up that Patreon. Yes, sir. He's a Patreon member. Absolutely, you should be a Patreon member. <laughs> two thumbs up to Eminence. Excellent. <laughs>